Hi, my name's Andy York from Warner's Printers. We're often asked various questions about printing techniques and, and modern ways of printing. One of the questions that keeps coming up is variable cutoff. What exactly does this mean and how does it affect particular jobs? What I have in front of me here is the core of a reel. This reel of paper would have started off at probably four or five feet tall, would have been about a ton of paper on, on the actual reel itself. Traditionally, it was web presses that used to use reels of paper such as this. But more and more these days, sheet fed presses too can use reels of paper. Paper is more generally more cost effective to buy in reels than it is in sheets, thus affecting the final price of the finished job. Web presses have a set cutoff. That means that as the reel of paper goes through, the point at which that paper gets cut into a sheet is set when the machine is purchased and cannot be altered. Many modern sheet fed machines have the ability to take a reel of paper, which as we've already mentioned is more cost effective. What happens is, rather than staying as a continuous reel of paper through the machine, the sheet fed machine will have a piece of equipment that cuts it into sheets before it actually feeds into the machine. The point at which it cuts the reel into sheets is variable. It's not as a web press which is set, you can actually vary the point at which it cuts off that sheet. So for non-standard sized jobs, variable cutoff on a sheet fed machine allows the paper to be closely cut to the size of job that's being produced, i.e. there's less wastage of paper. I hope this short video has been useful. We're hoping to upload lots more information about the printing process over the coming weeks and months. There is information on the screen should you wish to contact us. Thank you.